Hey Primpack family, it's Bill Barlow, your Sustainable Innovations Manager. Um, hope everybody's doing well and staying healthy uh, given the circumstances that we're in. I know it's uh, troubling times for a lot of folks and uh, I just want to say on behalf of myself and uh, a lot of other sales folks and um, your product development and marketing and uh, your corporate people that in the plants, uh, we certainly appreciate uh, everything you guys are doing for us and uh, keeping us in business and keeping our customers happy and satisfied. Um, so we certainly appreciate that and uh, it's heartfelt and um, we hope everyone continues to stay safe and, and healthy. I just wanted to uh, give you guys a quick update. We're gonna, actually Miles and I um, are gonna take some of these packages uh, that we've been collecting here in my hand as well as uh, about two months worth of polyethylene based flexible packaging um, that we're not gonna be able to put in that curbside bin, uh, but we're gonna we've collected everything. And we're gonna take a run over to the local store and uh, show you guys about dropping these off. Um, and anything that you see here, I'm sure a lot of you have already seen these, but that's really the label that you're looking for. And, and if there's any uncertainty, but um, what you want to do is is basically collect these or any polyethylene-based packaging um, as long as it's clean and dry. You can take this to a local store uh, in front of store drop off um, and at front of store they're collecting these. Uh, there'll be several bins out there most likely so make sure you clearly um, or you read clearly what what bin is, is for what and it should specify um, plastic bags or um, in store drop up plastic pouches etc out in front of the store. So um, follow us along for a ride uh, over to the store and uh, we'll get these uh, put in the right place. So we made it to Publix. There are some bins out front of this Publix here. And so we're gonna see, hopefully they're not full because I have a lot that we've saved over the couple months. But uh, I'm gonna get uh, masked up and head out to the front of the store and see if we can uh, get these bags uh, where they need to be. Looks like we lucked out. We've got two plastic bag bins right here in the front of the store. And hopefully we can get most of these in there. We'll see, uh, see what we can do. Okay. You can see how full it is already. So people are obviously dropping them off and it does appear to be PE poly polyethylene based bag. It's a little less full. Cool. All right. Perfect. So we got most of the bag. We got all the bags in. Uh, so just again, if you want to go to howtorecycle.com or howtorecycle.info you'll be able to find out more information about how to recycle your polyethylene based packages and bags that you save at your house. So last but not least, here she goes. So now I challenge all of you, but my challenge for this next event goes out to our stewardship engineer Michael Knight. So Michael, Make it happen.